thanks so much for tuning in today. Hope everybody's doing well out there. And today I am sharing with you guys what I'm hoping is to be a Bath and Body Works dupe. So I love Bath and Body Works. I've, I've loved shopping there for long as I can remember. One of my favoriteest scents is their Stress Relief line and it's the Eucalyptus Spearmint. Absolutely love it. It's the most calming scent, it smells so good, has this really nice fresh scent, but it just literally is the most calming, serene, peaceful scent that I just absolutely love. Now, the other day I was in Bath and Body Works, uh, well, last weekend, and I was actually thinking about getting myself the lotion, um, you know, to use, and when I went to go look at it, I was kind of like, wow, um, did the prices go up or is it just me? I don't know. Something seems a little weird. So the bottle that is, you know, roughly, you know, about this size of that Bath and Body Works was like $16, which I'm pretty sure I remember it being about $12, not that long ago. They're now putting it in what looks like to be a glass bottle. Uh, I didn't see one in a plastic bottle. I was looking for it, but I'm I don't know if they're trying to stay away from the plastic because it's supposed to be like better for the environment. And I, I don't mind the glass bottle, that is totally cool, but $16 for one bottle of lotion. I don't know, I was kind of like, mm. so I just, I walked out, you know. But when I was at Dollar Tree a few weeks ago, I found this. And this is from Spa Luxury, which is not made by, um, the brand that makes the Dollar Tree products is made by Rejoice International Corp. They did have other scents as well, like the lavender. Um, they also had body wash in the lavender. And I was looking for the body wash that went with this Relax one and I didn't see it. So it was either out or they never got it in stock. I'm not sure, but I did pick up the lotion. And while I was actually in the Dollar Tree, I went ahead and did like a little sniff test. And I gotta tell you guys, this smells nearly identical to, yeah, a pretty darn close to the Bath and Body Works um, Eucalyptus Spearmint Stress Relief Lotion. I I'm not gonna say it's it's exactly the same. It doesn't smell exactly the same, but it's very close. And so I actually haven't even tried it out. And I thought, you know what? I'm gonna just give it a little go. I'm gonna just put some on my arms and try it out. So let's try this out and see if it can be a dupe for the Bath and Body Works stress relief lotion that I love. That is now $16 and this is $1.25. So I'm gonna take my rings off real quick and let's try it out. So it does have a little pump. The bottle is also very reminiscent of the Bath and Body Works stress relief. Let's see if the formula is runny. Not really. You know, you would think it would be runny because of the price point, but no, not runny at all. Actually, I would say it's actually very similar to the Bath and Body Works. Doesn't feel super thick, but let's give it a go. I'm definitely getting eucalyptus and I am getting like a mint in the background. I wouldn't say that it is identical to the Bath and Body Works one, but it does feel really moisturizing. It has like a thick feel to it, even though, you know, you would think the formula was kind of thin, but it actually does have a really nice kind of thick feel to it, very moisturizing feeling as well. Doesn't feel watery, like some of the Bolero lotions, which I don't like at the Dollar Tree. This one actually has a really nice, kind of thick moisture feeling, but it's not greasy though either. And the scent is very, very calming, just really nice. I wouldn't say it's as heavy of a scent as the Bath and Body Works. I think the Bath and Body Works definitely has more of a 
scent to it. This one, definitely a little bit lighter, but I can smell the eucalyptus. I can smell the mint and it actually smells really good and it feels pretty good. Yeah, that is really nice actually. I really like that. Maybe just a tad bit sticky feeling afterwards. It does have a tad bit of like a sticky feel, I guess. Um, but that probably does soak in. So I would actually have to wear this, you know, and I am about to go to work, but I would actually have to wear this for probably at least another good like 15, 20 minutes to really see, you know, if it um, soaks in pretty well or if it just kind of stays feeling a bit sticky. So I probably will go ahead and wear this and I'll kind of join you guys back. Maybe once I, you know, get to work and I'm parking, um, I can just kind of update you guys and let you know, you know, did it soak in pretty well, but it feels really nice. And my skin feels super smooth, super moisturized. The scent, like I was saying, just not as strong. So if you're expecting a really strong eucalyptus mint scent, you're not gonna get that, but it is there and it smells really good actually. I would say definitely if you see this in your local Dollar Tree, pick it up and give it a go. If you're a fan of the Bath & Body Works stress relief line, I think you guys would really like this one as well. And I will join you guys back here in just a bit. I'll just kind of let you know, you know, how it sinks in because for me, that's a big deal. I don't like greasy, sticky feeling lotions. So that is a deal breaker to me, but I will let you guys know. But so far I am giving this a two thumbs up. So join you guys back in just a bit. Okay, everyone. So as you can tell, it is a different day. It is actually the next day and I didn't even realize because when I got to work, I was in a rush, so I was late. And I was like, I don't have time to film this quick little, you know, snippet about the lotion. And so when I was like, I'll, when I get home, I will do it. So when I got home after dinner, which I went to go get something to eat, and then, you know, I don't know. I don't know, time got away from me and I just didn't film the snippet. So I know it's the next day, but I do wanna finish out this video and let you guys know about the lotion. So after I applied that um, lotion yesterday, I, you know, of course, you know, put my jacket on, went to work, whatnot. By the time I got to work, it had soaked in. So I would say roughly like 15 minutes or so, it was, you know, pretty soaked in. And, you know, it, it was totally not greasy. My arms were like very soft, moisturized, not greasy. And, you know, the scent of it, which I, you know, it's like a herbally fresh scent. Um, it lasted probably for like, I'm gonna say like probably 30 minutes after I applied it. I didn't smell it anymore after that. So, you know, um, lasting power, probably not quite as long lasting as like Bath and Body Works. Um, but that's kind of okay with me. I, you know, I don't really need something that's gonna, you know, have a scent on me like all day. It's nice. It's a bonus, but you know, for the price point, I'm not expecting that. If you did see it, I would definitely suggest picking it up and trying it out. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. If you're interested in more dupes, uh, do let me know in the comments section down below. I love filming videos like this, so I would be happy to film it for you. And I have got to get ready, so I will see you guys in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day or night, whatever it is where you are. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.